Hello viewers. Here is, I think, the biggest fan in my collection now, a Lakewood HV21T. And this is the second to last size I need to complete my collection. Now I'm just looking for the 12 inch one. So this one, it is the model with the thermostat, which I just find kind of odd because I can't really think of many reasons why you would want a thermostatically controlled high velocity fan because this isn't really a fan that alters the temperature in a room like a window fan or an exhaust fan would. It just moves the air around. But uh, it's there. Unfortunately, it appears as though somebody. Oops. It appears as though somebody has um, wired around it. You can see there is a jumper wire to avoid the thermostat. I'm not really sure why they did that. This would appear like it works. Of course I don't know that. The sound is not a hundred percent indication that it works. But um, that's probably easy enough to to fix or replace if needed. Um, this does have an oil hole for oil which is kind of cool doesn't have a hole in the front, at least I don't think so, but it does have it on the rear, so that's kind of neat to see on something that's this new. It's three speeds. It is uh, 3.2 amps, which is quite a bit of power. I don't see a date code out here any rears. Uh, so I'm not exactly sure what year this is from, but chances are I can find out maybe uh, up for servicing. It does have a removable cord, but at least it's the grounded type. It's, you know, it's like what you put in a computer power supply or anything like that. This thing is heavy. Um, how are we going to do this here? I think this is going to cause things to blow all over the place and make a mess. I want to avoid that if I can try and angle it like this, I don't even think this is going to really be letting enough air move around it, but that's the best option I've got. Move the camera over, and I'll plug it in. Let's make sure this is off. Okay, here we go with uh, low. These have a fantastic slow speed. I saw these out um, in a store once, in an antique store. They were being used in the store. And they were on low, and they were very slow, just like this. Although I think this may be a hair slower than normal because it's been sitting outside in the cold all day so the lubrication in the bearings is probably solidified. Well it's been in the house for probably almost an hour now. Let's uh, go up to medium. got like a whirring sound to it. And now we're going to go to full power. I gotta cut this off. That has got some serious power to it. That's probably even surpassing the power of the uh, the old five amp pattern. Oh, that could be massive stuff going all over the place. Probably should have done this video upstairs, but anyways. So that's cool. Um, 
how can we get the startup sound? Um, hmm. This is going to make a mess, no matter where I put it, I guess. I think the best option is going to put it on the floor. If the cord is long enough. Now let's take this off the tripods. fans are ready. Okay, well there we have it. That's the initial checkout, I guess, if you will. On this side, uh, it's a monster of a fan and it moves an insane amount of air. Thank you for watching. Comment, subscribe, and out.